to be fugly in, in today's episode. I'm going to show them poor little old pitiful um, welfare people how they can don't have no excuse to not look the best they can. Sometimes you just have to make do, but you can always find things around the outside. There's plenty of stuff around the house you can use. You just got to think outside the box. Well, shit. I reckon if you could, you wouldn't be on fucking welfare, would you? Well, here. Here's my advice to you. So, first, what's the first thing we always do, ladies, we put on foundation. And why do we want to put foundation on? Because it hides our little per imperfections and freckles. And you, when your skin don't look the same color nowhere on it. And for our foundation, we ain't going to look no further than Mother Nature. I found something to be a perfect foundation to hide all them blemishes. And just, like, while you're um doing this... You can think about, well, you know, it's it's doing two things at once. It's it's a, like a mud mask, what makes your skin all pretty, and it acts as the cover. You're getting in touch with your nature side. I don't think a leak gonna work. They start, and this is a pretty one. I maybe if I could like in. No, because we supposed to be going. We ain't going clubbing. We going to find a man or job. Oh, this ain't working. It's too dry. Wait it up. And then what you do is you use... Y'all you know I can teach y'all something. You always put your shit on your face with your ring finger. And then, then do you know why? Because it's the weakest finger on your hand. Look, see here what I'm making? It's kind of like gravy right now. But I think once you put it on... Your face, it'll work good. And now it's closer to my skin tone. Well, soon, because y'all know I like to sunbathe, and I get my kind of too tan uh, on soon, so I'll just have it ready. Let's see there? That just glides on. Oh, and it feels so spiritual. It's just like, oh, my God. Y'all, we ought to keep doing this. We could start a trend. This is what I was talking about when I was talking about being on welfare. There's always a, a way to make yourself prettier. And I mean, this is this didn't cost shit. I mean, I, I look like a Jersey girl. I look hot. I'll just get a spray tan into my other and get cooked on. And uh, I can't believe I got this shit here. I might stop making a... Uh, my own. Free. Just dirt. Okay, let me blend a little, little bit and then I'll be right back. All right. I think it's pretty even. What y'all think? Ain't got no blemishes showing? None of them. It's like a baby size. <laughs> oh. Dig this. It got uh, It got built in, um... Contour shit in it. So you like where you usually might have to use some blusher. You don't even have to. I think I look skinny. Alright, now the next thing we gotta do is think of what would work for for for, for uh, powder. We got to soften this a little bit. And anyway, so uh, what I done is I just r runned over next door at to Crystal. She wasn't home, but that whore, she just surrendered. I got the master key. This place is mine. I'm like, Trump. So I got my key and I let myself in because she always cooking cookies for them fat ass young and hers. Thinking I was going to probably use some flour. And, and if you got a food stamps, hey, you can eat this on your card. <laughs> it's elementary. Alright, ladies. Simple. All you got to do is get you a good pinch and then like sprinkle it around real even on your face. Get your brush if if you, it not, not, I ain't even talking about like that you scrub your toilet swell. See? Ew! What is that? I don't think it's dirt. And if you don't have no, no brush, you just do like this and you just blow. <laughs> I 
forgot to explain to y'all that I'd already done my hair because I started thinking about it like, oh, shit, three or four days ago, I reckon. Now, what, how to get the most looks out of your hair for really, you just get some of that, like, hair product what makes it be like bone eye stiff like it's just eh, like that and you just put it in right before you go to bed and then you can sleep it any way you want i mean i sometimes waller like right there and i don't i missed that part up but it yours might be right here look look at all the body and my hair is baby fine i'm telling you baby fine all right we're going back i'm gonna um show y'all now what we can think of to use for eyeliner. And you know what I come up with? If you got youngins, you got a Sharpie. And I mean, just think, if you using a Sharpie, it's going to stay on there for days. I mean, you you don't even have to wash it off. It just stay there. I got to lean in real close so I can see. So, now you, you going to have to be careful when you fucking with a Sharpie around your eye. Well, number one, it might get in there. And number two, it might burn or something. Well, no. And so, you, you gotta be a steady hand. That's why I'm always sure, glad. I am always make sure that I'm drunk when I'm doing my makeup. So, anyway, see? Now, that is some good eyeshadow. Saves your time. Saves your money. Saves your sanity. All at once. Okay, now the next step is just going to put on some eyeshaders. Y'all remember that cigarette I was smoking earlier? Look, I made my own wand. That is unbelievable that happened because that was just a co-winky dink. I was thinking I was going to have to stick my finger in them. And let me mix something else with this. I'm going to... I have to set this down for a second because I'm fixing the light a match. See all these matches. And see what it's got to strike on. Not a god dang thing. I, this drive me fucking crazy. So I'm going to have to... I'm just going to light it with my cigarette lighter and save its little ashes to do what I want to do. See, here's what you do. Now, see, you look what you get, and then you, you've got that little homemade brush, remember, that was the filter? You just grind that shit up, and we're going to put it on our face. So you just take your finger, your pinky, or some ring finger, and just dab it around in the ashes, and then, it, and then, and then here you go. Wow. That's unbelievable. Oh, shit, I lost some train of God, man. You know, if for them of y'all what don't know, I don't never start over, but what I might have to do is get some more of that powder that I used for face powder and tone that shit down because that's a little bit much. Now, since this is a little bit more tissue, uh, we're going to... Um, we're going to uh, add a little color somewhere. And if you got a potpourri stick, here's another you get two for one. Get you one of these incensors. See, like that? I done already gather my twos. And then you get a knife. And then you just scrape, scrape, scrape. Probably out of my makeup, except for, you know what? I call copyright. I call copyright. Perfume. Makeup. That's my idea. Copyright. Y'all DBs out there ever hear anybody out there gonna think they gonna um take that idea from me? I'll cut their head off and throw it at them. That's a little more pinker than I was looking for, so I came prepared for crystal size, and I got me some um, cayenne. Cayenne peppers. It must be Asian. But see, that's the kind of color I'm, I'm going to fill in with that just dash of color and then tone down this black, too much black shit I done. All you need is like one quick little smoosh on each side. There. Ain't that sexy? Plus, it's a nice work look, too. Oh my 
my god, where's my bear? WHERE'S MY BEAR?! God, oh, damn! I ain't never had nothing burnt like this before. Ah! Oh, that cold part. Oh, that feels so good. Oh, my God. Don't use no kind of hand paper for, um, I should or I'm sorry. I hope y'all wasn't doing it along with me. I apologize. Y'all already used cinnamon. At least I don't think that would burn. Thank God I had a couple of hydros uh, laying around. Uh, uh, people that always been trade their food stamps for them. Now, here for our last little section of the makeup where you make my wake up well fireman makeup over. One of them things, um, we we just gonna think of something for lipstick. Now, so, I done took some painkillers, alright? <coughs> so you just take your knife and you just Dab it into your finger like he's getting a heavy test or something. Like he's giving blood because you needed ten dollars <coughs> or something like that. Oh man, this is working perfect. Look here. Hold up. Oh my god. You know when it's your blood it don't really taste funny. I wouldn't want to taste nobody else's blood. I ain't on them vampire motherfucker. Now look how natural that look. I think I can turn this disaster here that made my squalor my eyes off. This can be fixable. I think I lost too much blood. I need to go drink something. I'm gonna get ready for my episode. So y'all get ready. And that's how not to be fugly. Welfare or not. This is Makeup on a Budget.